We've heard of self-driving cars hitting the roads, but this new six month long pilot is not only delivering 10,000 pounds of fresh food to seniors, it's researching how this innovative technology can help others. I just saw this uh, automobile that had no driver. And I, of course, was just like anyone. I said, where in the world is the driver? Sahara Russell lives in Rio Vista Detroit co-op apartments. And once he realized his community would be getting food delivered by this self-driving vehicle, he was just delighted. Uh, we are especially blessed to have Fords in the area and, and selecting us. More than 20 Rio Vista residents were already getting food deliveries from Ford Fund and Gleaners Community Food Bank. Because there are more than several that use walkers and, uh, or, and or canes, or in some cases cannot get out of their apartments. This pilot will double the amount of deliveries. We wanted to engage them with an actual autonomous vehicle delivery of groceries to understand what the um, customer experience would be like. This shuttle is fully autonomous, but always has a safety driver to jump in at any time. We get really excited about the technology, but we need to remember that this is really about putting people at the center and understanding mobility issues and where can this technology help people, not just for the technology's sake. The artwork you see on the side of the shuttle was created by a local artist and it represents the diversity Southwest Detroit has. I'm Megan Woods, Local 4.